Today we are going to do a session with Sir on Germany and Raj Yogas in profession. Sir, can we begin the session? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. yes. Uh, everybody mute your thing and some sound is I'm getting some some sound yeah. Okay. Um Shuklam Bradram Vishnam Sasi Varanam Satur Pacham Prasan Navadanam Dhaya Sharpa Vigo Vashati Hum Garana Amtha Garabati Kum Kava Maheka Vinkovi Namu Pastavastamam Jeshtara Jam Brahmanam Brahmanaspada Ana Shangman Nodi Visi the Sadhanam Prano Devi Saraswati Vaji Birvajini Vedi the Nama Vitraya Badu, Ganeshaya Namaha, Saraswati Namaha, Sri Guru Pio Namaha, Hari Om, Barbavas, that's a bit of very end of the code. They were said to be the Aditya is of my Mangalai Buddha, Shaburu Shokras and Mr. Aoki. Okay, good morning, everybody. Okay, this is actually uh, uh, not the whole of uh, Jaimni is Raj Yoga. Uh, Jaimini's Rajyokas can be extremely very complicated and difficult compared to Parasari ones. I'm just taking one bit of Jaimini's Charakaraka, which is very easy. Everybody, you should be using it. Uh, all of you all know what is Atma Karaka, Amitya Karaka. But how do you integrate it? How, uh, nothing much is actually written uh, or explained regarding its actual usage. Uh, there is a very wide usage. In fact, if uh, if you can blend Parasri Yogas with these Jaimini Charakaragas, you'll, the understanding of Raja Yogas itself will be totally very, very different. So I, I'll just this introduction session is part of my profession course. I'm just giving you something uh, very, very important regarding uh, how to use Jaimini Raj, uh, Charakaragas and Raja Yoga. So first, the most important thing, see Raja Yoga basics is mainly a Kendra and Kendra lot or a Kona and a Kona lot or a Kona and a Kendra lot. Naturally, this uh, depending on the planets, if it is Sun, Moon, Mars, Raja Yoga planets, uh, it, uh, it gives power if it is Mercury, Venus, uh, Moon, uh, it gives uh, finance, uh, it is Dhana Yoga. So the basis of any Raja Yoga is a Kendra and a Kona lot conjunction. So naturally, uh, it, uh, it depends on the planet, Moon, Jupiter, Moon, Mars, Mars, Jupiter, Mars, Sun, Sun, Jupiter, Mercury, Venus, uh, Venus, Saturn as Kendra lots and Kona lots change the whole picture. Who becomes the Kendra and Kona lot will change. Moon and Jupiter as five and nine lots. You know it is Gajagayasri Yoga. Moon and Mars is Ch Chandra Mangala. Uh, Mars, Jupiter is Guru Mangala. There are a lot of huge Panchamahapurusha. There's so many yogas uh, are there. This is basic of uh, Parasri Yogas are there. But when you blend the Jaimni Charakaraka into this scheme, uh, uh, you will understand Parasri or your yoga itself in a different perspective or a different dimension or in a different light. Let's see how it goes. See, it is AK, AMK, PK association. The first most important is AK, AMK, PK. You can also take DK. DK is more for finance. It is uh, uh, okay. AK, AMK, PK association with the 5, 9, 10 lots. You can take the Lagna lot or the combination in a Kendra corner. AK, AMK, PK association with Sun, Moon, Jupiter, Mars in 1, 5, 9, 10. It's a Raj Yoga. Yes, in the Kendra also is it very, very good. Okay, see the, uh, the actual introduction is AK is like the Lagna. Some people say it's the ninth house also, like the Lagna. It is our core characteristics. Uh, it rules our desires, potential or the innermost uh, of ourselves. It, why it's called Atma Karaga is... It's not actually the Atmagara. It is our innermost self which we have carried down from different births. It shows us. Lagna will show the outer uh, characteristic of, of what we have developed uh, is the karma. The Atmakaraga, which is the high planet of the highest degrees, it shows our uh, accumulated personality. The Amitya Karaga, the planet uh, with the, the second highest degree, it's like the 10th house. It shows a professional achievement, success. So it's uh, next very, very important. 
everybody knows even in my class i have explained a lot about the conjunction of ak amk and avamsa dasamsa how important uh, rajyoga forms with this but um, i'm just one more dimension is very very important putra karaka putra karaka is like the fifth house so all of you all know what is fifth house mainly as far as yoga is concerned power learning fame government uh, 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 everything uh, celebrity status everything pk so this is very very important ak amk pk Uh, and the next one is DK. DK is like the second or the seventh house. It gives prosperity, harmony, harmony, happiness. In some very cases, you will see most of the multi multi billionaires having the DK uh, very well placed. So the yoga gets strong when the association is in each varga, especially in D one, D nine, D ten, and D sixty. So in basically for for a beginning mm-hmm. learning, you'll have to find out. whether a kendra kona uh, lords are conjoined together and one of them becomes the uh, is the atma karaka amitya karaka putra karaka you will have to uh, you will have to understand so how it breaks down will be is like this so it is like atma karaka and amitya karaka conjunction or mutual aspect or association Uh, atma karaka and putra karaka conjunction or mutual aspect atma karaka and the fifth lord conjunction or mutual aspect atma karaka and dharaka conjunction or mutual aspect amitya karaka and putra karaka conjunction or mutual aspect so amitya karaka and fifth lord con- uh, conjunction or mutual aspect amitya karaka and dharaka uh, conjunction or mutual aspect putra karaka and fifth lord conjunction or mutual aspect putra karaka and dharaka karaka conjunction mutual aspect fifth lord and dharaka conjunction mutual this is i think i've covered uh, some of it you can if you want have a much more stress say atma karaka strength i, I have told you the, uh, it is not the lordship alone uh, it is a strength also so if who becomes atma karaka if the lagna lord fifth lord ninth lord tenth lord becomes the atma karaka and it is well placed in a good house in a kendra kona in dignity in swakshetra uh or in dikbala uh, uh, in parivartana if it is well placed and well also it is one of the highest uh, 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 raj, uh, rajyogas uh, okay and one another very important atma karaka and the ninth lord is one of the best combinations imagine uh, i what i say in my professional uh, the samsa class i have showed you just ak amk uh, combination uh, in the dasamsa in the lagna of uh, 10th house is one of the the greatest uh, raja yoga formations the, uh, okay uh, next is the atma karaka and the ninth lord uh, uh, combination it gives a lot of spiritual strength wisdom learning illumination uh, 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 so you see this where i i'm just going trying to i explain to you is yes the 159 uh, the kendra kona lords and the charakaraga lords blend it together with uh, depend on who becomes the atma karaka namitya karaka if it is sun moon mars or jupiter uh, uh, they are all power planets or you you if you have it as mercury venus uh, saturn uh, it is more of finance uh, a different level of course so next it is the same atma karaka namitya karaka with the same combination um, uh, uh, it will take you to a different level of raja yoga so ak amk in 6 8 12 the opposite uh, flip side will be will give you dura uh, yoga and a challenging life or ak amk nicha or amk with uh, with malefic planets you can just stretch it i'm just giving this is a hit so an afflicted weak ak amk can be very bad so for a, for the basic we all know a kendra kona lord conjunction uh, in a kendra kona is a raj yoga but it this will be more special if one of them is the ak amk pk or dk and if the uh, conjunction happens so it is like sometimes you might think uh, uh, let's say the 10th lord is just with the second lord or seventh lord, uh, or, or just a lesser lord lord but if one of them becomes uh, the ak amk the yoga will change so it is more special if it naturally if the ak is also a trinal lord or kendra lord, uh, lord and it's one of the power planets sun or moon it is much more better but it is it can still be powerful even if they are second and 11th lord and if the ninth or 10th lord uh, conj- uh, conjoins with a ak or ak okay any doubt so far we'll go about to six example charakters i'll explain to you to show you but any doubt so far i will explain to you more sir i just yes, want right. to ask one thing yeah uh, now if ninth lord and uh, ak hmm. are in uh, you know uh, uh, 
exchange of houses then also yes yes it's a yoga yes so, see the thing is see we know uh, uh, what is a we know uh, basically parasri yoga we know a uh, kendra lord and kona lord yeah we're just extending it let's say uh, uh, what is a uh, dhamitya karaga is just a second lot maybe he is not uh, a powerful lord a second lord 11th lord even it can be 6 8 12 lords also but just by the virtue of becoming the amitya karaga or atma karaga combining with the ninth lord it will change the picture so the lordship matters the lordship is very very uh, um, uh, matters so if, if it is a good lordship it, it enhances the atma karaga or adamitya karaga quality so you will have to understand that jemini charaga the lordship the natural the characters of the pla uh, planets combined together will form a very very important yoga okay. so you are saying you are saying the ninth lord of atma karaka becoming ninth lord no 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 atma karaka and the ninth lord combine if the ninth lord itself becomes atma karaka it is excellent okay it is very special if the ninth lord or the 10th lord becomes atma karaga it is one of the uh, that is one aspect that is one aspect it is also yeah, yeah. let's say if the atma karaga conjoins with the ninth lord also it is another rajayoga atma karaga conjoined with the 10th lord or in the 10th house itself will act like a dharma karma yoga yes i understand what mm -hmm. my question is different yeah ninth lord becoming at atma karaka well placed well placed in norms very are, good very good if it is ras itself in d1 itself is very good if it continues in uh, navamsa the bakya is very good if it is in dasamsa you are it is mahatmala great uh, uh, results will follow so that is just on the basis of ninth lord becoming atma karaka yes yes okay it is ext extreme uh, if the uh, uh, atma karaka is the fifth ninth or tenth lord or even lagna 5910 you can take it uh, in the ascending order you are, uh, you can take it it is more special and in what dignity also if it is uh, yeah. it's exaltation and swakshatra it be very good and if it's well placed in another kendra kona it becomes extremely very very special okay hmm? got it thank you yeah okay any other doubts so i think you are, you are getting the basics okay uh, a kendra kona lord combine they <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I'm not able to get it. What is it? Okay. Okay. Maybe we let's go over an example chart. We'll understand better. This this is Narendra um, uh, Modi's horoscope. Okay. Uh, see, many people say uh, he uh, what I say is Scorpio lagna, Tula lagna. We'll stick it with this. Uh, I uh, for me this works. But uh, anyway, the karagas will not change, whatever be the lagna. Maybe the lordships alone will change. Uh, okay, just taking with the Jaimini karaga. See, he has a Saturn-Venus combination. Normally, okay, this is a lagna lord, uh, so Venus with the fifth lord, fourth and fifth lord. Saturn combination is one thing. But if you look closer, Saturn is the Atma karaga, Venus is the Amitya karaga. Okay, then you, you go on to see uh, there is a Chandra Mangala Yoga. It is just not an ordinary Chandra Mangala Yoga. You can find out Mas is the Putra Karaga conjoined with the 10th Lord. So the 10th Lord conjoined with the Putra Karaga in the sem, uh, second house. You, you, you know you, you, what I say, he became the Prime Minister in Moon Dasa. He continues to, to be the Prime Minister in Mas Dasa also. What I say, and if you if you can look closely, I'm just going to for, as far as this class, I'm only going to explain the Rasi chat. Rasi chat? Yes, you can yes, see these. You can see these. Hello. Hello. Okay, I'm hearing my voice. I thought somebody's talking to me. Okay, you can see these same combinations. Your uh, these uh, AK, AMK, PK, uh, continuing to be powerful in other Varga charts also. You can see it to continue. That's I'm stressed. So, but I don't want to confuse you all to make it too detailed. Just make it very very simple. How important uh, what I say if a person has who who becomes the AK, AMK, and PK, and then uh, most important if they are well placed, and you can you can see in his horoscope. Uh, they are in mutual kendras. So this is little more. This uh, this is not just Narendra Modi. Rajiv Gandhi has AK, AMK, PK, Simal Lagna. In Simal Lagna, he has all of them together. Queen Elizabeth has this. She is Capricorn Lagna with AK Jupiter, AK Mars in Lagna. Queen Julian in Netherlands, Aries Lagna with AK Mercury, with exalted fifth lord sun and PK Venus in Lagna. President George Bush has his President Joe Biden. I just put 
uh, just for uh, a lot of most of the celebrities you take any celebrity you can see this uh, what i say ak amk combination continuing in ak uh, all the pk one of them or all in d1 d9 d10 you can see it's a very very combination in most of the celebrities channels this what is if it is just in uh, the d1 chart yes is successful but if it continues in the varga charts up to shashti amsa he is a world renowned person i'm just marked you certain you know, few people here okay we'll just move uh, okay maybe from uh, narendra modi to donald trump okay the uh, donald trump you can you can see his lagna lord sat uh, sun is the ak moon it's it's a full moon and it's on an eclipse what is a uh, uh, it is amk you can see his pk mass is in lagna all in r in kendra all are in mutual kendra lagna kendra paka lagna kendra chandra kendra you, you can if you can go deeper and see you will see these three planets being very powerful again in avamsa dasamsa shastiyam so continuously these th planets will be very very powerful as far as rashi chart they are all in kendras and in mutual kendras and just not lagna kendra it's chandra kendra and paka lagna kendra also okay any doubts yeah what this, if uh yes sir what if the same planet becomes uh, uh putra karaka and also 10th lord very good it's as one of the raj yogas but just by that uh, yes if it is well placed uh, in and well associated the yoga is very very special treat the putra yeah. karaka is like the 5th lord If, uh, what is it? Just treat it any any planet becoming the putra karaga is, is as equal as being the fifth lot. If the putra karaga is also a lagna lot, fifth lot, ninth lot, tenth lot, makes it more special. So you'll you'll have to understand accordingly. If the putra karaga is a sixth, eighth, twelfth lot, okay, uh, it uh, it it has a lesser or, or the meaning changes slightly. So for a first trade raja yoga, if the chara karagas are kendra kona lots or just one five nine ten lots, are, it is very good. It does not mean if they are six eight twelve, then will not give yoga. They will give yoga. But for us, simple understanding: if the chara karagas yeah. are one five nine ten lots or a kendra lot, it is more easier to uh, uh, what is say delineate and predict because it gets so complicated. If it happens, yeah, if it happens in second house or eleventh house, will it be? it will be uh, it will give you dana yoga it will give you yeah. dana yoga yeah if it happens yeah. in the house of power in the fifth or tenth it gives you power fame everything it give if it's just yeah. in second or 11th house it gives you finance okay thanks yeah yeah yes sir any okay okay this is we go to uh, engineer actually uh, uh, uh okay <sighs> Okay, see her uh, AK is the so first thing you will see. This is this horoscope or the DK. We are always talking about AK and AMK and PK. Let's see about the DK. Her Dharakaraga is Venus. It is in Lagna. You can see up till Chastity Amsa D1, D9, D10, D60. Shukra DK is in all the Lagna. Shukra in Lagna, in all the uh, most important Varga cell by itself is a uh, Raj Yoga. As Shukra in Lagna itself, you will know she is a celebrity, uh, an actress. So one thing. Okay, where is her? Uh, okay, AMK Jupiter is the ninth lord, and a PK Moon is the Lagna lord. Both are conjoined in the ninth house with the fifth and tenth lord mass. So you can see. One, five, ten, uh, nine lots conjoined, and uh, one, uh, two of them are PK and uh, and AMK. Okay, you can see. If you want to go deeper and see, see Navamsa, Dasam, Sastiam, Sir, she will continue to have these planets strong. For now, we'll just uh, stick on to just uh, uh, what happens when the one, five, nine, or the Kendra Kona lots are also. Uh, the Jaimini Charakar, especially AK, AMK, and PK, and if they are well placed, uh, what is it? What happens? Uh, 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 what is? You will see that Parasri Raja Yoga is in a different light, much better. If what is it? If the one five nine lords are you know, do not get the AK, AMK, it is a different. It's a lesser. Uh, the Raja Yoga is a lesser light, but if they become AK, AMK, PK. the raja yoga paras uh, becomes totally different especially if they are in good dignity in good association it becomes stored this is what i want to tell you the this is very simple if you blend jaimini charakaragas with parasari basic raja yoga scheme you will understand 
to yoga as self in a very different light but because you will be you will see some charts with pancha mahapurusha yogas not functioning well for swakshetras for exaltation three not working well many people having gajagestri not functioning well guru mangala why budhati yoga everybody will be having why it's not functioning well there are some missing rules we'll have to understand it closely one of the rules which is very very important is that jaimni uh, charakaraka so you blend it with the normal parasri yoga so you will understand completely the what is a para uh, parasri uh, raja yoga is in a better light okay amita bachan so this is very very important horoscope i keep on taking his horoscope because the moment anybody sees his horoscope oh four planets in the eighth house how come is a superstar such a famous why 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 many many questions are there simply you just take his ak sun amk mercury pk uh, uh, venus all together conjoined in one house okay you can see them continuously in avams and dasams so most important thing is sun so uh, ak amk pk all of them conjoined together what more you want okay sir so, but another example you can probably take yeah is this this software that you are using nasim yeah. rao yeah his eighth house you look at it lagna lord yes uh, there are three or four planets in the eighth house yes 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 Na you mean nasim rao's chart yes Yes, I know, I know. Yeah, he's Kanya Lagna, no? Yeah. Mm, yeah. I don't know. I don't remember <laughs> Chara Karaga ski, but yes, I know. Many people have yeah, this eight planets. Not only Narsim Rao, uh, Osho has it. uh i a lot of cel celebrity uh, i think uh, silver star stellan has it uh, I, uh many people i've seen with my, many play manmohan singh has it with uh, three right. planets in eighth house is dhanur lagna with three planets in eighth house but then see if you understand it's not six eight out if you combine the charakaraga scheme the, the combination it will be totally different that's what i'm saying if you simply use only parasari bhavas six eight twelve a, a bad bhavas it will give you downfall but then who are those bhavas a uh, planet you, you will have to see there yes venus mars uh, Ma mars is the 10th lord venus is yoga karaga mercury is the 5th lord and then if you combine it is also the uh, it is a uh, jaimni uh, if you say it is the ak amk and pk together it, uh, yeah, it comes hmm. yeah, yes sir. i was just referring to it because you are using that software uh, easier sure, sure, for sure. you <laughs> yeah definitely definitely he is made made uh, a big uh, what is it to astrology by his software yeah okay this is another of my favorite uh, uh, celebrity chart it's pele a football star just trying to take different different fields an actress a sportsman a politician i was trying to take it so pele you you know he won the football cup he's still a very powerful icon so you uh, you can see is ak mercury Uh, his moon amk is exalted in the 10th house his ak mercury and amk moon are in mutual aspect in the 3rd and 9th house okay conjoined with pk so it is uh, you can say uh, it is jupiter uh, uh, ak uh, all, all conjoined together you can see, look closely you want for your homework Navamsa, Dasamsa, Shastiamsa. These three planets will continue to be there. Here you can see. I think it is also the DK conjunction in his horoscope. So these four pillars: AK, AMK, PK, DK. A lot of research. I've just kept for DK uh, in a, for my professional course uh, to uh, how well DK is there for multi-billionaires. You can see the importance. DK can will also be the first celebrities when conjoined with important planets. DK can act. Is it yeah, because it acts like the second and seventh lot? There are other aspects of DK also, uh, but for now these four are the yoga for forming pillars of the horoscope. If they are well associated uh, in a good Kendra Kona house with a natural Parasri uh, uh, Raja Yoga combinations with good planets, uh, you will understand the uh, the yoga scheme better. Yeah. Okay, this is Bill Gates again. Some people give this as Katakalakna. Some people give Mithunala. I think Katakalakna works better. 
okay you, you can uh, first thing anyway whatever you take the the charakaraga scheme will not change the lordship will change it will not matter much as far as uh, academically concerned it will not uh, let's say what i say it should be better see the most important thing is ak saturn amk venus are conjoined the uh, fourth lord and seventh lord are conjoined together uh, in ashvakshatra and in exaltation you can see this is putra karaga moon is in the ninth house for finance is one of the richest persons in the world why because his his dk is jupiter which is the ninth lord is sitting in the second house so i'm just giving you one example of one of the wealthiest person in the world his who's his dk jupiter what is jupiter jupiter is the ninth lord where is he sitting he's sitting in the second house okay so important well I've, uh, I actually I wanted to put Denzel Washington's horoscope where his DK is also Jupiter. Uh, he he was Kanya Lagna uh, with Jupiter exalted in the eleventh. But then, or, or what I say, he was an actor. So I thought this should be a more a better horoscope than showing uh, than Denzel Washington. I'll I'll keep it for the class. As far as this is concerned, Bill Gates horoscope you will know. I make one billionaire's horoscope. Yes, he has a AK AMK combination together, but most important, how how important is his DK? Yes, DK is Jupiter. First, DK becoming Jupiter as the nine and the ninth lot and in the second house makes it especially well. See, this Gemini, there are other Rajayogas. When you see uh, the Hora Lagna, Gatik Lagna, Aruda Lagna, Karagamsa Lagna, uh, what do you say? There are other special yogas that you need a little bit mastery on how to use them. Yogada, Maha Yogada, uh, many other aspects are there. But this is a very simple thing. I think uh, it will no complication. You all already know about these yogas. You just add the Charakaraga scheme to the whole thing. Then you will understand the yogas better. There's a little more deeper uh, things. It is. Then actually, there is a flip side of it is uh, how this can become uh, yeah, Avayogi also. What happens if this AK, AMK, uh, uh, PK are Nietzsche, in 6, 8, 12, or afflicted? Uh, if they do not come uh, with, uh, join us uh, uh, with good lordship, what happens to the horoscope? So this is another question. But yeah, you, you can understand. If they, if they, if they form as uh, good, good lordship and good association, it becomes a Rajaga. If they are 6, 8, 12, large, weekly place, 6, 8, 12, with malefic combination, it is, it's, it is our yoga. Okay? Okay, any doubts? I've just finished with a small session on, okay, J Jaimini, Characaragas, and uh, Rajyoga scheme. How you, you blend Parasiri, general Rajyoga scheme with Jaimini, Ch Charaga. You can add it, you can make it. There are some more uh, Jaimini. It's not all of Jaimini. Jaimini, I will, uh, what is it? How to use Gati Lagna, Hora Lagna, Aruda Lagna, Karagamsa Lagna. Uh, there are a lot more uh, very important yogas, but that will be like an advanced aspect of Gemini. But this is a very simple, I think everybody can, in a 15 minute session, you can easily understand and master uh, uh, what is a uh, uh, Raj Yogas, general Parasri Yogas, blend the Gemini Karagas and understand the whole yoga in a different perspective, in a deeper level. You'll understand it totally. Just look into your own horoscopes and find out which planets, which planet lordships becomes. Uh, who becomes the Atma Karaga, who becomes Samitya Karaga, the Putra Karaga. You just see the whole picture. It's not the just the one fight dying lots. Which planet becomes? is who, if Sun, Moon, Mars, Jupiter, these are very four important planets. If one of them is uh, is the AK, AMK or PK, it's very good for Horus. All three of them are the AMK, AK and PK. It's especially very safe. There are three sets of planets. The Saturn, Venus, uh, Mercury uh, becomes one set, and one is Sun, Moon, Mars, Jupiter. They are, they are control powerful planets. If all of them just become the AK, MK, PK, or DK, it is a, uh, you understand the horoscope in a different light. As a ruler's chart will always have a, a person with great control will always have the AK, MK, uh, PK as Sun, Moon, Mars, Jupiter. This is just an uh, introduction. I'll be explaining the whole thing with much more deeper, uh, what is say, uh, rules. Uh, other rules are there, how to use Aruda Lakna. There's another concept. You will add up more magic to uh, understanding Gemini with, with uh, Gati Lagna and Hora Lagna. If you understand the yogas, this will, you will understand the complete picture. We will see in the, uh, in the profession class, you see every class will be seeing about 30 charts. So 300 charts will be seeing. I'll be employing all these rules in all, all, uh, all the horoscope. 
yeah any doubts you have so far so i think what i say we are what is uh, uh, start employing this chara karaga karaga into the uh, raja yoga understanding you will understand it totally uh, different sir yes sir ha uh, sir just one uh, question that uh, amitabh bachan's chart we saw all yeah. ak amk etc are there in yeah. the 8000 mm. so what what is the 8000 effect he would have got because of that or see the 8000 uh, uh, what is it? the uh, actually what, what is the 8000 houses it is the 11th house from the 10th house don't ever forget that see uh, you want to un- understand a particular baba how you understand it is it from the lagna only it is 8th house for understanding a particular baba from each other baba what is that particular baba see if you want to understand about kids uh, uh, it is 5th house why it is 5th house is for kids it is 11th from the 7th okay the union the, uh, the profit of a union is the 5th house or a physical union is the 8th house 10th from the productivity of the physical union is the 5th house so 11th from the 7th and 10th from it's the same thing each bhava uh, what i say uh, how are they mutually connected there are three four bhavas which can be very powerfully connected which enhance the bhava or it can harm the bhava so, so as far as profession is concerned 8th house is the 11th from the 10th house so a uh, replanet in the 8th house why uh, they say they give sudden gain or I mean a, a sudden rise in life or a malefic can give you a sudden fall why a malefic planet in the 8th gives sudden fall because it is 11th from the uh, 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 10th house so it it is he is not having four planets in the 8th house they are 11th from the 10th house and imagine a planet in the 8th house all of them will aspect the second house if you see if you uh, if you uh, no somebody has to mute it, uh, please mute yeah okay okay so and, uh, so and if you yeah i'll i'll add one more factor to it see there is uh, something called rasi aspects for a rasi aspect for, as far as amitabh bachan chart is concerned if you see all the planets are are not only aspecting second house for dana it is aspecting rasi aspect 11th house and 5th house all the ak amk pk is aspecting second 11th and 5th house if you want to, i don't want to complicate in the uh, i just wanted to make it simple but if you employ rasi aspects all the planets in the 8th are also connected to second 11th and 5th house but sir how yeah. do you take a rashi aspects matlab they are weak all du- weak dual aspects. planets du- all dual planets aspect dual signs uh, no that i know but are yeah. rashi aspects considered weaker in character no no there is a slight difference in meaning in understanding the pl- uh, meaning of uh, planetary uh, aspect and rashi they are not they are not weak they act- actually very very strong it's a pattern why what i say rashi aspects is like a pattern Uh, why uh, mobile signs are connected to fixed signs or fixed time so it's, it's a whole pattern of understanding uh, a particular uh, uh, bhava it's it's i'll have to explain to you uh, uh, very important only then you will appreciate the, the as- uh, importance of aspect i will maybe i will explain it i'll explain it in the class rashi aspect is very 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 important you it's not weaker aspect it is like a connect always fixed signs are connected to mobile signs all dual signs are always mutu- always connected so if any planet is in a fixed sign it all it's immediately connects to all the mobile signs and any planet in a mobile sign is already connected to the fixed signs so it's very very important what are the planets in mobile signs because the mobile pl- planets are uh, maybe in in uh, what i say in pl- uh, graha aspect it can be there but uh, if if for 1 5 9 lots are there only in mobile sign they may not be associated with each other but they all of them will aspect they will have an influence on the fixed signs so you so you will have to understand uh, which are the planets which are falling only in the mobile sign and all of them are influencing the fixed sign so this is a very big secret of uh, uh, what is understanding it's very simple to understand uh, uh, planetary aspects uh, rasi aspect a lot of secrets are there a lot of secrets are there a lot of foundation basics are there to uh, uh, to un- actually understand 
Right. So, but as far now, I can tell you, Rasi aspect is as important as possible, especially if you are using Varga chat more than Graha aspect in Varga chat, only use Rasi aspect. It will have a stronger influence. In, in the Rasi chat, yes, Graha aspect will be strong. In a, in, in a Varga chat, Rasi aspect will have a more stronger influence. Okay. Yeah. Yes, sir. Any other doubts? Yeah, the difficult part about the 8,000 in Amitabh Bachchan is that he, he did have a fall. He did have problems with, uh, you know, accident and all that. And he lost a lot of money at one point of time. Figuring yes. it out, figuring it out when it's going to happen and dasa, whether, you dasa. know, which one is going to take the dominance. Yes, it's the dasa, the continuation of this, which dasa he had. Maybe it's, see, we see the eighth house is, as only in D1 chart. But what happens? What is Virgo in Navamsa? What is Virgo in Dasamsa? Or the planets which are falling in Virgo, what is it? Are they still falling 6, 8, 12 in Navamsa, in Dasamsa, in Sashtiamsa? A planet, four planets in the eighth house could be in the eleventh house in a Navamsa and Dasamsa. The meaning will change. But yeah. a planet is very susceptible. If it is in eighth house in the Rasi chart and it's again in Adustana, in Navamsa alone, it can be very bad. Or if yeah. it is Nietzsche or in a Pabamsa, if it is there, it can be uh, very bad. So it, it has a susceptibility of getting easily afflicted. But you, you cannot say it is bad because it can be exalted or it can be in a Shubhamsa, it can be in a Pushkaramsa. Uh, it can be very powerful in Avamsa. It can change the whole picture. Mostly you will see doctors, uh, have, what is it, uh, uh, what, uh, only having planets in 8th or 6th. 10th Lord in 6th or 8th in Rasi, Navamsa, Dasamsa. Somewhere the 6th eight connection in all doctors chat, you will, uh, it is very, uh, we'll be seeing, at least 10 medical doctors will be seeing. Uh, this is a very common factor to be seeing. True. Yeah. Yes, sir. So we are used to see when we are used to see when any anybody has too many planets in the sixth, eighth, or twelfth house. We think the horoscope is uh, bad, but actually, you are, uh, it is the field of activity. Uh, sixth house, uh, an army person can be there. He can be, uh, a, a, or, uh, and uh, he can be an advocate and some challenging jobs. Twelfth house is hospital related far away places, journeys. It can be. It's the only thing you'll have to know if they are afflicted. Their six eight twelve can be bad, but if they are strongly placed, a plan you don't you just understand the planet will give the result of the particular bhava. That's all. Don't treat it. Uh, don't understand planets in six eight twelve as bad. If they are well associated, you gain from that bhava. But if it is afflicted, even in five nine, you can or say a planet can be in a very nice house and still can be very bad. Tenth house is house of sannyas. Sometimes uh, uh, the wrong planet in the 10th house it can mean sanyas. Saturn, Ketu, a Nietzsche planet, four planets in the 10th house can all mean sanyas. They're not exactly sanyas. can mean you can do nothing. The, uh, the house of actually uh, the uh, what you achieve is a, a, a planet in the 10th house. Your, high, your highest understanding uh, is your 9th house. 9th house means God. It's not just God. Your understanding of your God the God, the God which you are, Aham Brahmasmi, is the ninth house. Fifth house is your basic, how you, what is it, blossom forth and understand the world. Your romantic self, your enthusiastic self, your creative self. The ninth house is your, your, your how, how much you can understand that you are God itself is the ninth house. Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, use this. Uh, it's a very, very interesting concept. I'll explain to you all. Once you, you all have this strong, I, I will tell you all how to use uh, what is a Hora Lagna, Gatika Lagna. And when you mix Chara Karagas with Hora Gatika Lagna, Arda Karagamsa, you will, you will complete the picture. Okay, but you have this, uh, uh, this basic as uh, Kendra Kona Lots. Uh, take when you're analyzing Kendra Kona lots, also see who's the Kendra Kona lots 
and then just see if they are atma karaka amitya karaka putra karaka or dara karaka if one of them is that and then see the yoga scheme you will see the whole horoscope differently it you will you, any celebrity horoscope or not celebrity horoscope even a basically a person a ceo who is in a company who is earning 1 and 1/2 lakhs you will you will be 100% sure he will have ak amk pk tk at least one of uh, two of them conjoined together in rashi alone he will have a basically person who is uh, at least by 30 35 earning 50 60 70 000 will have this combination so you can be very sure this is the most common thing your your gajagasti may not work your chandra mangala may not work your any pancha mahapurusha yoga you might have four exaltation and you will you are, my maid has four exaltation it may not work but this rule will definitely work what you can commonly see people with exaltation and and you will wonder why exaltation does not work okay so we'll come out with more interest in the class we will go into uh, many 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 interesting things uh, i'll be uh, what is say explaining to you, uh, much more than this this is just the gemini perspective last time when i i taught, taught the profession i i gave the karana perspective we'll also be using the karana uh, uh, method also here i i thought what is say i shall highlight the gemini perspective now we'll be seeing from the karana uh, aspect Uh, we'll be using the nakshatra uh, method of seeing profession uh, will be the varga we'll always being the seeing the profession uh, the profession will be shown in d1 d9 d10 in, in certain charts what it says uh, it will also be shown in shashti am sorts okay so we'll as take, we are talking yeah as we are talking yeah. about classes yeah or the classes that you are going to take yeah can we have it at the same time at 6:30 in the evening because that suits people living in us okay we'll i'll i'll talk to shika i said few one or two people ask me also then we'll okay it's not a problem for me we can have it like also sir only yeah. said sir i asked you and you said uh, it thing not 6:30 is not a problem ma'am i thought 8 8 o'clock or something might become late if it's 6:30 is not a problem now we have Seven. already announced the course at 10 am okay, okay so others might have a problem Okay, you just find out maximum who says, and we'll decide. I will just ask those who have enrolled if they are okay. Then we'll hold it. In maximum, it uh, we we just check it up. Uh, uh, for me, it is not a problem. Sir, is no, six o'clock about... okay for you? No, six ask... o'clock in the evening. Yes, I will I ask the other participants if they are ready. We can take it at six. Yes, ma'am. Six o'clock, six thirty in the evening. IST is fine. Okay. Sir. I will ask those who have registered if they are okay with it. Yeah. Every Saturday. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank yes, you so much. So yeah. we are going. Uh, we are going to start the profession course again. Due to uh, many wanted to join and they had missed last time. This this course will start on the Akshar Titiya day. That is the twenty second, and it will be every. Saturday, the day is fixed, and we'll decide the time and let you. Please do enroll for these sessions, and those of you who have not subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Okay. Meet you, everybody in the class. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.